All right, folks are starting to come in. Good morning, everybody. Happy snowy day here in New Hampshire. Um, we didn't get too much at my house and it's light and fluffy, but it is really pretty. Um, I'm definitely more of a spring through fall girl, but there is something to be said for you know waking up in the morning and having just a beautiful snowy day. And we're here to have a really celebratory day. So we're very excited. Uh, one of our newest members to the chamber, Altrix Primary Care in Nashua has opened their doors and we're really excited to be able to help them celebrate this morning um, doing a little formal ribbon cutting. But we also want to give all of you the chance to get to know them a little bit, find out what makes them different. We were chatting offline beforehand about, um, you know, some of the challenges behind finding primary care providers and uh, their model is really interesting and um, we're definitely going to learn a little bit more about them this morning, help celebrate them and we're glad that you're all joining us. So with that, I want to turn things over to Wendy to get us going. Thank you so much, Kate. And I'm going to take off my mask so I can speak with you all this morning. Kate, Chairwoman Zimmer, Senator Shaheen, Representative Custer, Mayor Duchess, the team of Altrix Primary Care, and our honored guests to include our business partners, Colby Compton, representing LabCorp, and Connor Lyons, managing partner at Nashua Physical Therapy. As the COO of Altrix Primary Care Nashua and America's Nurses, it is truly my pleasure to welcome you today to this ribbon cutting ceremony. This marks our official opening. We believe that the opening of this clinic in Nashua specifically demonstrates our investment in this city and its people. At Altrix Primary Care, we are committed to providing comprehensive, person-centered primary care to the residents of Nashua and the surrounding communities. COVID-19 has identified the cracks and the gaping holes which exist in our healthcare system. Primary care practices already struggling to hire and retain primary care providers have been decimated. Despite the worsening pandemic, more than 1.4 million healthcare jobs have been lost. To put that into perspective, that's equivalent to the number of residents in the state of New Hampshire. Many primary care providers on the verge of retirement have decided to retire earlier than planned. Large hospital owned organizations have closed primary care offices, and consolidated clinics, leaving hundreds and thousands of Americans and New Hampshire residents without primary care providers. At no time in history is a national investment in the primary care system and a relationship with a primary care provider more essential. With the opening of Altrix Primary Care, we are providing opportunities for residents of this community to establish a relationship with a primary care nurse practitioner someone who cares about and is invested in their health. As a nurse practitioner for the last 30 years, I am so proud to stand beside this team. Together we, the four of us, have more than 110 years of cumulative healthcare experience, most of it in primary care. We have assembled the best of the best, women and men committed to delivering the highest quality personalized care in the state and surely in this city. I have no doubt that anyone who chooses the nurse practitioners at Altrix Primary Care for their primary care needs will leave this clinic feeling welcomed, feeling heard, and feeling cared for. We will be your partner in your healthcare journey. It is now my pleasure to introduce our lead nurse practitioner, Nicole Tsoulakis. Tsoulakis, sorry. <laughs> Good morning and thank you, Wendy, and all honored guests. I wanna take this opportunity to say how honored I am to have joined this team and I'm grateful to represent Altrex Primary Care in our national community. Yes, the Altrex team that we have assembled is strong and I really believe our greatest strength is gonna be our approach to care. In only a few short weeks, we've had the pleasure of welcoming our first patients through our doors. And this truly speaks to what Wendy has identified, a need for primary care in this community. Our new patients have already begun to experience our unhurried whole health model of care and can always expect to be treated as our family. We are committed to providing the same excellence in healthcare that we expect our, for ourselves and our own families. 
I am excited for the journey ahead and I thank you for joining us in our official opening of Alteryx Primary Care. And I would like to introduce our amazing practice manager, Becky DuPont. Thank you. Good morning. I'm excited to be partnering with such amazing people, including America's nurses, my COO, Wendy Wright, and nurse practitioners, Nicole and Steve. I believe in the model of nurse practitioners, led practices providing unhurried care, and it's super exciting to bring this to the greater Nashua community. The feedback we have already received from our new patients is full of gratitude. We are doing lots of great things. Thank you, Becky. Unfortunately, Steve Gutwillig, our nurse practitioner, is unable to join us today. So now it is my pleasure to introduce our honored guests. Senator, representing Senator Shaheen, I'd like to invite to the podium, Peter Clark. Well, thank you everyone for, for having me here today. Uh, Senator Shaheen is in Washington and couldn't be here um, herself, but she asked that I read this letter on her behalf. Dear friends, I wish I could be with you at today's ribbon cutting ceremony for Altrix Primary Care's new facility in Nashua. Please know that I join you in spirit as we celebrate the vision and hard work that brought you to New Hampshire and will continue to drive your efforts to support the health needs of families in the region. We come together this morning, not only to official, officially open this new facility, but also to highlight the impact of an organization that seeks to deliver high quality primary care in a region with a, sh a shortage of providers. I offer my thanks to the nurse practitioners and staff at Altrix and my hope that you will continue your hard work in a field so focused on serving and assisting others. Your efforts are helping to ensure that everyone in the region has the opportunity to receive top of the line, full range primary care, including wellness exams, checkups, prescriptions and immunizations, COVID testing and care, and teen and women's health care. I have no doubt that together we can continue to mobilize our efforts until all who need it enjoy access to the kind of effective and efficient patient-centered care that you strive to deliver. Congratulations once again, and best wishes to you all as you continue your good work. Sincerely, Jean Shaheen, United States Senator. Thank you, Peter, and thank you to the Senator from all of us. She has been a huge support for nurse practitioners, and we are very, very grateful for all she has done for years for us. So please give her our best. And now representing Congresswoman Annie Custer's office, I'd like to welcome Tom Giancola to the podium. Well, thank you so much. Um, great to be with you here. <clears throat> uh, the Congresswoman uh, was unable to join, but she has uh, sent a letter which reads as follows. Dear friends, thank you so much for the invitation to join you for the ribbon cutting ceremony for the Altrix primary care facility. Although I'm unable to be in Nashua to honor your work, please know my thoughts are with you as you celebrate the new primary care facility benefiting the health and wellness needs of the Nashua community. We hear too often of the many vulnerable Granite Staters struggling to find access to health care. Now more than ever, health systems across our state and our country have experienced significant challenges in reaching our vulnerable populations. And we must remain committed to ensuring accessible, reliable testing, immunizing those at greatest risk of COVID, while championing support for community health services. On behalf of my constituents across New Hampshire's second congressional district, I thank Altrix, our nurses and community leaders who saw this project from conception to completion. You are all part of what makes the Granite State the best place to work, live and raise a family. Sincerely, Ann McLean Custer, member of Congress. Tom, thank you so much. And please give our thanks to Congresswoman Custer. We know it's a really busy time and she too has been a huge advocate for nurse practitioner and nursing led care. So thank you again. Kate, on behalf of Mayor Donch's office, I believe that there is a statement and I'm wondering if you may be able to read it from the mayor. Yes, of course. So it, it is an actual document, which you will get a copy of afterwards, but I will read. So recognition, celebrating Altrix primary care in Nashua. Today, we celebrate Altrix primary care in Nashua as a new member of the Nashua Chamber of Commerce and a welcome addition to the Nashua business community. 
Altrix Primary Care belongs to the Altrix Primary Care family, an affiliate of America's Nurses, an organization working to create a national network of practices led by nurse practitioners. We wish them many years of success. And with a personalized approach to healthcare, a variety of services for all ages, highly trained and qualified nurse practitioners, and a mission to offer innovative care and support to patients, Altrix serves seeks to be a real partner in health and foster a comforting and caring environment for all. There will surely be an asset to Nashua's healthcare network. And thank you to Altrix nurse practitioners, Nicole and Steve, practice manager, Becky DuPont, and chief operating officer, Wendy Wright, and the rest of your staff for opening your doors in Nashua. And Altrix is in good company, joining the Greater Nashua Chamber of Commerce. The chamber cares for our community and puts its members front and center. Its vision of a vibrant, thriving Nashua for people to build a business and raise a family, and mission to be a primary catalyst of Greater Nashua's diverse business community, show a great understanding of what Nashua is all about. Thank you to Chamber CEO Kate Lesko for gathering everyone together today. And I, Jim Donchus, Mayor of the City of Nashua, New Hampshire, do hereby recognize Altrix Primary Care Nashua as a special part of the Nashua community. I love that. That's awesome. Thank you so much, Kate. And thank you to Mayor Donchus. We wish you could have been here today. Now, there is one honored guest that uh, has, is not going to speak this morning, but I do want to call out Jillian Belmont, president of the New Hampshire Nurse Practitioner Association, who I believe has joined us today. Uh, and thank you, Jillian, for taking time out. Uh, nurse practitioners, uh, we're so proud that you're here and representing the NHNPA. So now, without any further ado, Chairwoman, uh, Chairwoman of the Board, and my lifelong mentor, Phyllis Zimmer. Oh my goodness, mm. that's quite an accolade. Thank you, Wendy. Good morning, everybody. Uh, I am so excited to be here today. I had absolutely planned to be in Nashua, but a little thing called a pandemic got in the way. So while our Altrix team heads down to cut the ribbon, I wanted to take a few minutes to say hello. I'm gonna to try to remember to look at the little green light instead of staring at the text in front of me. Today we're celebrating. We're celebrating that this month, once again, nurses were rated number one by the public as the most trusted and ethical of the professions in the latest Gallup poll, an honor that we've held for 19 years in a row. We're celebrating that 23 states and two US territories have full practice authority for nurse practitioners, enabling patients to take advantage of the care that we can provide. We're celebrating the contributions of nurse practitioners to healthcare. Americans make more than 1 billion visits to nurse practitioners every year. And we're celebrating the opening of Altrex, which by the way means nurse in Latin, Altrex Primary Care, a practice that will help fill the urgent need for primary care services in Nashua and a practice that will showcase nurse practitioner led care. We believe that nurse practitioners are ideal providers for primary care right now. And we believe that they are the future of primary care in the United States. We have a 50 year track record of success and we know that nurse practitioner care increases access to care for patients. We know that nurse practitioner care makes a difference in the health of our patients. We know that our patients value the relationship that they have with their nurse practitioners. This practice will become a flagship practice for us. And it is, it is this practice that is the launch of the Altrex primary care brand. We hope to build a national network of NP practices across the country. Our nurse practitioners will provide care that is distinguished by our commitment to quality, our ability to coordinate care, and the help that we give our patients in navigating a really complex healthcare system. But most important of all, Altrex Primary Care will be known for the relationship that we build with each and every person. We want to be known as the practice where all patients are welcome and all patients know that their care is our priority. We're eager to become a valued part of the healthcare community 
and we will be eager to work with the other healthcare professionals in Nashua, as well as the employer community, so that we can help achieve a higher level of health for the citizens of Nashua. As the president of America's Nurses and Altrex Primary Care, I have the honor of, of doing the thanks. So I'd like to begin by thanking our distinguished guests for their support in celebrating the launch of the practice today. I also want to thank the Nashua companies that have worked with us these past months to help us open this practice despite a major pandemic. We know it has not been easy. I'd especially like to thank the Nashua Chamber of Commerce for working with us to launch a new business during such a challenging time. Finally, I want to acknowledge the above and beyond work of the Board of Directors and our stellar team on site in Nashua who brought this dream to reality. Wendy Wright, Becky DuPont, Nicole Sockless, and Steve Gutwillig. And now I'm gonna turn over the, the uh, stage to Wendy, Becky, Nicole, unfortunately not Steve today, um, but I'm so eager for them to cut the ribbon. And then following our ribbon cutting, we invite those of you who can to please stay with us and we will do a virtual tour of the facility. So thank you and welcome to Altrex Primary Care. Thank you so much, Phyllis. That was fantastic. Uh, looks like the team is set up here. So let me, there we go. All right, so as is tradition, unfortunately we're not all there in person, but this is the super fun part. So if you wanna turn the scissors just a little bit to the side so we can see, maybe we can see them there. All right. Woo! Nice job. <laughs> There's lots of clapping, even if you can't hear it. Very exciting. Congratulations. So we are going to get led on a tour if folks want to stick around for a few minutes. Um, Dylan, who has the camera here for us, is going to take us on a tour of the space. We were hoping that you'd just stay on for another five minutes and give us a chance to show you our beautiful facility. I'm going to turn the video off as we go back up inside and we'll be right back with you in just a couple of minutes but again thank you for joining us in this ribbon cutting all right so we'll give them a couple of minutes to get settled um very exciting. I, I was saying when we were chit-chatting a little bit earlier uh, before we got started that uh, I'm in need of a new primary care doctor. So I'm definitely going to have to call my insurance company and see um, if these folks are in network. It's a really hard thing to find and um, everybody's, you know, doctors are busy and it's a whole new challenge that they're having to deal with, right? So um, it's really, I, I'm a big fan of innovation. It's really neat to see that happen. I actually grew up in uh, Canterbury, for those who know Canterbury, where which is home of the Shakers. And um, one of the things that they were known for at their time was being really innovative with different practices that, that they put forth and things that we still use today, things like the flat broom, right? Just a regular, what we think of as a regular old broom, um, the Shakers created back in the day. I don't think they sort of recognized how innovative they were at the time, but it's a really neat thing to be able to, um, to celebrate when people uh, think outside the box. So it looks like we are back. Let me make them big for us so we can see. Can you see All me right. okay? Yes, it's perfect. Perfect, so welcome to our beautiful facility. It is really my pleasure to take you on a guided tour today. So welcome to Altrix Primary Care Nashua, an affiliate of America's Nurses. Come on in. As you can see here, we have a check-in and a check-out station. And as we go by my computer, we're gonna to need to turn off the volume. So just give me a second. Okay, let me just put my things down. 
Welcome to our waiting room. This is a shared waiting room that we share with both our physical therapy partners and with our lab core. So let's take a look into Nashua Physical Therapy. Connor, as I mentioned, is a managing partner of this facility. One of the things we love about having physical therapy on site is that when we see a patient who's injured, has some type of orthopedic complaint, we can actually walk them in and we can have them evaluated and they can even start therapy. You know, as an NP, I often find that patients may not go if we give them a referral, but if we do a handshake and walk them in and they can meet that physical therapist, it often goes a long way to improving their care. So let's take a look at this beautiful, bright facility. You can see it's all set up for a comprehensive physical therapy program. And we've got private tables over here so that people can get the manual physical therapy that they need. So this is our, this is a Nashua physical therapy. So let's go along now. Let me take you back into our waiting room. And this will be a full service laboratory operated by LabCorp. This will be allow walk-ins. This will allow outside patients to come get their labs done here as well as our patients as well. So this will be a comprehensive on-site laboratory operated by LabCorp. And again, our mutual waiting room. Let's come along, Dylan. We're gonna go take a look at our front office. This is where our check-in and our check-out occur. And you can see just a little bit of the look behind the scenes. One of the things we wanted here was that this office didn't look like your typical medical office. We wanted it to really look warm and homey, and I think we've really accomplished that. Let's take a look in our walk down the hallway, and you can see that this is our, our meeting room, our lunch room. This is where our staff is able in good times to be able to congregate and to have lunch together. Come on down the hall. And we're going to go into one of six examining rooms. And I love them. They're bright, they're beautiful, they're homey, they're welcoming. Again, we feel like this is the feel that we wanted to create in this office. And I think that we've really done that with our choice of colors and with our choice of equipment, etc. So this is your typical adult exam room. We also have a pediatric exam room. We are full service primary care here. We take care of infants all the way up through older adults. And this is our pediatric room. So when kids are scared and needing to get vaccines here, this is more of a fun and kind of welcoming room for them. This is our pediatric exam room. And again, another typical adult exam room. And as I said, we have six of them here. So we are fully equipped to be able to handle patients with multiple providers. I'm just gonna take you down the hallway into what we're using now as our consulting room. One of the things that the NPs like is to be able to talk with patients and just sit and have a conversation. So a lot of the visits are actually started here at the table and then we'll move them into the exam room to be able to examine them. We also have surgical capabilities minor biopsies, procedures. We can do EKGs, and you can see some of our equipment here. We can do IV rehydration. We have that capability. So this is our surgical room. We are now gonna take you into our on-site lab. We have the capabilities here of doing what we call a lot of point of care testing. So when patients come in, we can test them for strep, we can check their urine for a urinary infection, we actually have COVID testing. Although we don't do it in-house, we actually have an outside tent where we see people in their cars. We do have the ability to run rapid COVID tests and we have those results in anywhere from five to 15 minutes. So we have on-site laboratory testing as well. And the last hallway I wanna walk you down is the hallway into the provider, the nurse practitioner's office. One of the things we really like is to be able to collaborate with one another. And so the nurse practitioners share a common office space. This is where they're able to make their phone calls, able to document, and they're able to consult with one another and bounce ideas off of each other. So this is the nurse practitioner's office. 
So it's really been my pleasure today. I thank you all so much for joining us today for this ribbon cutting. And I'm gonna take, um, uh, we're gonna now go off video. And uh, I hope that this has been a great event for all of you. Tell your friends, tell your family, we are open to new patients here at Altrix Primary Care in Nashua. Thank you. Thanks, Wendy, and thanks for the behind the scenes. That was really fun. I was thinking, how often do you get to see some of those faces? Um, certainly. So that was a really fun chance. So thank you again to all who joined us today. We did record this. So uh, if you wanted the chance to sort of share it with a friend and let them hear it directly from the source, uh, what the organization does and how they're different than everyone else, uh, we will have that available for you. So thanks again to all who joined us. Congratulations to Altrix Primary Care and welcome to Nashville. We're very glad to have you and enjoy the rest of your Wednesday, everyone. Thank you.